We have the boat in the water. We are going to do it to it. It is so calm out here. We've been trying to find our gig and the first night opening season, there was not that many people down here, but the weather was off and on. We had umbrellas staying out of the rain. But right now we are going back because the water is extremely calm. Hopefully the clarity of the water is a lot better. We're about to find out. clarity of the water is a lot better than what it has been but if there was any wind you wouldn't be able to see anything at all it's a lot better than what it has been usually it's clearer than this but this is this is doable oh here we go already You ready? Yeah. Good job. He's border. He, yeah, he's no, he's he's big. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yep. Yeah, there's one. Ain't even been in the water for 30 seconds and I already got one. Already got a flatty. Let's get another one. Oh yeah. This is like what we want right here. Look at that uh, lizard fish in the water. You see him? <laughs> He's chilling out on the bottom, sleeping. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah. He definitely well, he was caught on the... Nice. Let me see. Oh yeah. Number two. Come on, Flounder. Two in the boat in the first two minutes. Here we go, here we go. Ready? Oh. <laughs> One moment. I'm trying to see. see him? Oh yeah. He was laying up in that. He was laying up in that hole. <sighs> nice. He's a good 18-inch flounder. All right, guys. Here we go. There's another. Put them in the boat. They all about the same size. They're about between 16 and 18 inches. Oh, gaff is stuck in there. Don't put me in the net, boy. <laughs> There's another, guys. Number four. So you guys that don't know, we in North Carolina, 
and the limit is four per person with a minimum of 15 inches and when you flounder gig it is hard to judge a flounder sometimes if you're not sure don't stab it those four fish there they were definitely keepers just by the look of them um, we went actually fishing for them this morning and we caught eight flounder and believe it or not only one out of the eight were keepers I cannot believe that and that was down in a different area and the water clarity down there is like river water though so it ain't nothing like this oh guys I didn't get this one on camera for you but I do got him in the head <laughs> I, I caught him off the he was in the in he was in the daggone um uh, in the mud I almost didn't see him because the stupid minnows keep dirtying up the water see how the water is dirty up guys that's because these minnows are swimming at the boat and the drum are feeding on everything and, and it's, they're just dirty up the daggone water and I hate it number five number five we saw a small one and I'm like well there's a well there's one there's another and there was about 10 feet up here we go see him see him Number six. Number six. Hurry up, boy. Get that thing under control. He is a wild one. Number six. One of the cool things about Flander Gigging is that you can see all the amazing underwater creatures. Um, you know, if you're into that kind of stuff, which I am, I like little pinfish and the little rock crabs and the blue the blue crab uh, the lizard fish the skates you know the flounder the red drum i mean they're everything's yeah uh there's big conks we we'll see if we if we find a big conk we'll try to build a big conk up for you and show you how big these things are down here all right here we go you ready 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 good boy smell them, I smell them. Right up on the oyster shells. Right up on the oyster shells. Nice. Nice. Hold the light on them. Nice flounder. All right. All right, guys. There's two conch shells. They're mating. And a boat just hit them, so I just destroyed their moment. go guys uh, shine the light on them okay. shine the light number eight number eight I told you I smelt them I smelt them hey guys I just missed a flounder I totally didn't even see him I was trying to move the boat and he was right beside the boat that sucks man it is what it is Let's get back at it. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Down. Down now. Down. Woo. Oh, nice. Yeah, he's bigger. That's number nine. All right, guys. I am heading back to the dock. There's a big thunderstorm coming out of nowhere. It formed and there's nothing we can do about it. So let's get the boat back on the trailer. We got a pretty bad storm sneaking up on us. It just kind of formed out of nowhere and it's, it ain't big. But it's the fact that if it pours out rain, the uh, chances of that water getting dirty are pretty good. So we got nine flounder. Missed one because I didn't see it. We got that rock crab ball. And uh, we'll show y'all catch in the morning. Man, I am tired. 
but we had a successful night. We had three people on the boat. We got nine flounder. Uh, you can have four per person, minimum 15 inches. The sizes that we got, the biggest one was 20 inches on the dot. The smallest was 15 and a quarter, and everything else was in between that size up to 19 inches. An amazing night. Um, I was hoping to get three more, but that daggone storm started coming in, and, and we had to quit. We got up to the boat dock. It was funny, and uh, everybody, <laughs> everybody that was flying a gig, and I swear it was like 20 boats had come in at one time. They're like, "Oh no!" They just started rolling on in, and, and we got up there first, and we were able to get out real quick. Uh, but we got ourselves a nice rock uh, rock crab claw. Um, and uh, those things are pretty good and they're pretty, they're pretty sweet. Uh, but let me show you the catch. Guys, if you like that video, give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. Make sure the notification button goes off. That way, when another video comes out, you know when it's on there. Uh, also, follow us on Facebook at Southern Backwood Adventures. And um, if you want to send us something, look down in the description below, and you'll see that P.O. box down there. Other than that, guys, we're going to see you on our uh, next adventure. And don't forget, there's an adventure that waits for you.